I am with the legend Dionne Warwick and today's a big day for her but we just want to honor her and her legacy and it's really all about community. Yes it is, always will be. Inside East Orange City Hall we got a chance to sit down with living legend Dionne Warwick. More than six decades in the music industry, she's done it all. Her proudest achievement, she says, her school in East Orange. We visited her school back in January. Warwick went to school there herself back in 1946. She was a guest on our Monica Makes It Happen show asking for community support. I thank you enough for thinking of us. There, she's known as Mama D. students who she affectionately calls her babies performed at a special street renaming ceremony for the icon Friday. Three, two, one. The street renaming, what do you what do you think of that? that um, you know that's right up there with the naming of my school. You know, it's something that's going to be here forever and ever and ever. Her biggest fans came to honor her, including legendary music executive Clive Davis. How, How much do you love this Dionne Warwick? I loved Dionne Warwick for decades and decades and decades. So I would not miss an event like this. If she asks, I'm there. The most emotional moment a tribute from her sons. She is a, truly a living legend, and uh, she's done so much for the world. And I mean, her accolades are just as long as as long as from here to probably Mars. If someone wants to talk about your legacy, what would you say your legacy? I have not, I don't think I've reached um, the part where I can give you any information on what my legacy is or will be. I have too many more years left. Well, all I can say is you're all heart. You're all heart and soul. And it isn't just about music. It is about what you've done for the children. And if you want to give to her school, we're going to link you there at Monica Morales TV on all of our social media platforms because we still need funding for that school.